This is how you import data files from other manufacturers into Roxim. First go to the manufacturer's website and find the data file. Uh, here on this particular website it says download the data file here so I'm going to click on that and it's got a zip file so I'm just going to save it right to the desktop. And sit and save and now it is saved. Okay, while you can't see it, I'm just going to double click on the file on the desktop. And I clicked it. And then I'm going to go here to extract all files. And it's going to put it into a new folder called Bluetooth, da uh, Bluetooth Roxim Data. And it's located on the desktop. Make sure that when you download, you know where you put the file. Because if you don't know where you put the file, it's going to make it harder to import into Roxim. So then I'll just click on the extract button and it is now done. Okay, on the desktop is now a, a folder called Bluetooth Roxim Data. And we close that out. And I'm going to go into Roxim. And I have Roxim running in the background. So here is Roxim now. Uh, from the file menu, choose Import Database Files and it's going to ask you where the files are. So now I need to find that folder that I have on the desktop. So I'm going to go to the desktop. Now there's the folder. And click OK. So now it sees the folders in there and it will automatically put it into the right location where Roxim is installed. So I'll just click OK. And when it's done it shows you what has changed in your database. And that's it. Now you're ready to use uh, the new files in the Roxim.